What's up, everybody? Today we're gonna to solve inverse Laplace transform or transfer function or whatever you wanna call it from the s domain to t domain, the time domain. There are many methods to do this, um, depending on your professor. There's a residue method or even the algebraic method. What we're gonna do is I'm not gonna go over that process. I wanna use this right here to help us, you know, crank down the numbers so you can check your work later because during a quiz or exam, if you can use one of this like I did when I was in school. It'd be helpful to make sure your answer is correct. So let's get into it. So what you do here is, you know, is you have to understand the concept, of course, is break it down to partial fraction or the, the general form of the partial fraction. Ooh, sometimes even plus D plus E. I would hate to be in that class. So, so what you do is, you know, you turn it on and type down the function. Instead of using S, I'm going to use X. It's the same thing. Now make sure this part, you take your time to type it because if you type it around wrong, you might get the wrong answer in the end. And you know how that goes. Now let's double check, make sure it's correct. Yep, it is. Okay, so you clear that up. You go to F2 or Window. Highlight, Expand. Enter, press up, highlight it, enter, close parenthesis, and enter. There you go. There is your A, B, and C. So let's copy that down. So that is 2 over S. The B is under 2, so there's minus 8. S plus 2. C is 3. 7, 7. S plus 3. Okay. So I'll skip all the algebra work, the boring stuff. Okay, so here is your partial fraction that you want. Now, you use this table or memorize this table, depending on your professor. Lucky for me, I don't have to memorize this. Now we have to apply it. So let's do it. So here, so this is V of S, so now it has become V of T, time domain. So here you have a 2 u of t minus 8. You look at the chart, it looks look kind of like that, right? So you just copy this down. E minus, well, what is a? A here is 2. 2t two plus, oh, oh man, see? I remember that I forgot my u of t right here before. The professor was brutal, took like 2 3 points off. So next is plus 7. Right here, so you go the same thing e minus 3 of t u of t. Now you can clean things up a little bit by factoring out the u of t. And there you go. Voila! Simple, right? Good luck.